Hi, I'm hi, I'm back. I'll be me be, be reading some more from the Book of Mormon, another testament of Jesus Christ. Of Jesus Christ. I will be reading two Nephi chapter nine. Chapter nine. Jacob explains that the Jews will be gathered in all. Their lands are promised. The atonement wants Rants a man from the from the fall, the bodies of the dead will come will come forth from the grave and the and the spirits from hell and from paradise. They will be judged. The the, the atonement says from say says from death, hell, the devil and an endless torment, though and endless torment, the righteous are to be to be saved in the kingdom of God. Penalties for sins are set for the Holy One of Israel is the keeper of the gate. About 559 to 545 B.C. B.C. And now, my, my beloved brethren, I have read these... these these things that ye might know concerning the covenants of the Lord that he has that he has coveted with all the house of Israel that he has spoken unto the Jews by the mouth of his holy prophets even from the the beginning down down even from the beginning down from, from generation to generation until until the time comes that they shall be restored to the true church and 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 restored to the true church and fold and fold of God when they shall be gathered home to to the lands of their inheritance and shall and shall be established in all their lands of promise behold my beloved brethren I speak unto you these things that ye may rejoice and and lift up your heads forever because of the other blessings which the which the Lord God shall bestow upon your children upon your children for I know that ye have such much many of you to know of to know what things to come wherefore I know that ye ye know that our that our flesh must must waste away and die nevertheless in our bodies we shall see God. Yea, I know that ye know that that in the body he shall he shall show, show himself unto those at Jerusalem from whence we came, for it is for it is, is expedient that it that it should be among them, for it for it behoveth the great creator that he that he suffereth himself himself to be to become to become subject unto man in the flesh and die and die for all men that all that all men might might become subject unto him for as death hath pa passed for as death has hath pa passed upon all men to fulfill the merciful plan of the great creator there must need, needs be a power of uh, a resurrection and the and the was and the resurrection must need must needs come unto men by reason by reason of the fall and the fall came by reason of uh, a transgression a transgression and 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 because man became fallen they were they were cut off from the presence of the Lord of the Lord. Wherefore it must need needs be needs be an infinite atonement, save it should be an, an infinite aton atonement. The this co this corruption could not could not put on in corruption. Wherefore the first judgment which came Upon man must needs have, have remained to an endless duration, and if so, this flesh must 
half of it, have laid down to what and to and to crumble, to which to his mother earth to rise no more. Oh, the wisdom of God, His mercy and grace. For behold, if the if the flesh should rise no more, our spirits must become subject to that to that angel who fell, who who who. who. Subject to that angel who 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 fell from 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 before the presence of the eternal God and became the devil to rise no more, and our spirits must have become like unto him, and we and we become devils, and and we become devils, angels to a to a devil to be to be shut out from the presence of. Our God, and to remain with the, with the Father of lies and misery, like unto Himself, yea, yea, to that to that being who who beguiled our first parents, who trans who 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 transformeth Himself nigh unto an unto an angel, a light and storeth and storeth up. The children of men unto secret, unto 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 secret combinations of murder and all manner of secret works of darkness, of darkness. Oh, how great the goodness of our God who prepareth a way for our escape from the grasps of the of this awful monster! Yea, yea, that the that monster death. Death and hell, which I call the death of the body, and also the death of the spirit, and because, and because of the way of, of deliverance of our God, the Holy One of Israel, this, the this death of which I have spoken, which is the the the, the temple, the temple shall deliver up. Its dead, which death is the grave, and this death of which I have spoken, which is the spiritual death, shall deliver up its dead, which spiritual, which spiritual death is hell. Wherefore death and hell and hell must 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 deliver up the dead and hell and hell must 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 deliver up its captive spirits, and the graves must. Deliver up its captive bodies, and 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 the bodies and the spirits of men will be was will be will be restored one to the other, and it is by the power of the resurrection of the Holy One of Israel. Oh, how great the plan of our God! For on the other hand, the paradise of God must deliver up the spirits of of. The righteous and the grave deliver up the body of the of the righteous, and and the the spirit and the body is restored to itself again, and all men become incorruptible, incorruptible, and 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 immortal, and they all live, and they are living souls, having a a perfect knowledge like unto us. In the flesh, save it be that our that our knowledge shall be perfect, shall be perfect. Wherefore we shall have a a perfect knowledge of all our guilt and a, and our uncleanness and our and our and our and our nakedness and the righteous shall and the righteous shall. Have a perfect knowledge of their enjoyment and their righteousness, being clothed with purity. Yea, even even, yea, even with the robe of righteousness. And it shall come to pass that when all men all men shall shall pass from this first death unto life, in so much as in uh, in so much in so much as they. Uh, have become immortal. They must appear before the judgment, the judgment seat of the Holy One of Israel, and then cometh the judgment, and and then must they, must they be judged according 
to the holy judgment of God. And as surely as the Lord liveth, for the Lord for the Lord God hath spoken it, and it is his eternal word which cannot pass away, that they who are who are righteous shall be shall be righteous still, and they who who are filthy shall shall be filthy still. Wherefore they who who are filthy are the devil and and his angels and the and his angels, and they shall shall go away into everlasting fire prepared for them and their and the torment and the torment is is as a lake of fire and brimstone whose flames ascend, ascendeth up forever and ever and has no end. Oh, oh, the greatness and the justice of our God, for he executeth all his, all his words, and they have, and they have gone forth, and they have gone forth out of his mouth, and his law must be fulfilled. But behold, the righteous, the saints of the Holy One of Israel, they who have have believed in the Holy One of Israel, they who have endured the crosses of the other world, of the world, and despise the shame of it, they shall they shall inherit the kingdom of God, which were, which was prepared for them from the the foundation of the world. And the joy shall be full forever. O oh, the greatness of the mercy of our God, the Holy One of Israel, for He, for He delivereth His saints from that from that awful monster, the devil, and and death, and and death, and death, and and hell, and and that lake of of fire and brimstone. And brimstone, which which is which is endless torment. Oh, how great the holiness of our God! For we know with all things, and there is and there is not any anything save He. Save He knows it, and He cometh into the into the world that He may save all men if they if they will hearken unto His voice. For, for behold, he suffereth the pains of all men, yea, the pains of every living creature, both men, both men, women, and 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 children who belong to the to the family of Adam, of Adam, and he suffereth this that the, that the resurrection might might pass, might pass upon all men that all. That all my that all my might stand before him at the great and judgment day. And, and judgment day. And he commandeth all men that they that they must repent and be baptized in his in his name, having perfect faith in the Holy One of Israel, or the or they cannot be saved in in the kingdom of God, and if they will, will not repent and and believe in His name and be baptized in His name and endure to the end, they must they must be damned for for the Lord God, the Holy One of Israel, has spoken it. Wherefore He has given a law, and where and where there is no law given. There is no punishment, and where there is no punishment, there was no condemnation. There was no con c o n d e m n a t i o n, and where there is no c o n d e m n a t o n, the mercies of the Holy One of Israel have have claim upon them because of the because of the atonement. For they are delivered by the power of Him, for the atonement satisfieth the demands of His justice upon all those who have not, who have not, who have not, the law, the law given to them that they are that they are delivered from that awful monster, death and hell and the devil, 
and the lake of fire and brimstone, which it which is endless torment, and they are restored to that God who who gave them who gave them breath, which is the Holy One of Israel. But but woe unto him that has the law given, yea, that has all the the commandments of God like unto us, and that and that transgresseth them and 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 that and that wasted wasted the days of his of his probation for awful is his state oh that cunning plan of the evil one oh the vainness and the and the fallities and the foolishness of men when they are alone they think they are wise and they and they hearken not unto the unto the counsel of God, for they, for they set it aside, supposing they know of they know of themselves. Wherefore, their 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 wisdom is foolishness, and it profiteth and it profiteth them not, and they and they shall perish. But to be but to be long is good. If they if they hearken unto the counsels of God, of God, but woe unto the which who are which as to as to the things of the world, for because they are which they despise the poor and they and they persecute the meek and the heart all upon their treasures. Wherefore their treasure is their is their God. And and behold, their treasure shall shall perish with them also. And woe unto the deaf that that will not hear, for they shall perish. Woe unto the blind that that will not see, for they shall for they shall perish also. Woe unto the the uncircumcised of heart for knowledge of their. Of their iniquities shall smite them at the last day. Woe unto the liar, for he shall, for he shall be thrust, be thrust down to hell. Woe unto the murderer who deliberately killeth, for he shall die. Woe unto the, unto them who commit, who commit whoredoms, for they shall be thrust down to hell. Woe. Ye. Thrust down to hell, yea, woe unto unto those that worship idols for the devil of all devils delighteth in them, and in fine woe unto all those who die in their in their sins, for they shall return to God and behold his face and remain in their sins. In their sins. Oh, my beloved brethren, remember the awfulness in trans in transgressing against that holy God, and also the awfulness of yielding to that to the enticings of that of that cunning one. Remember, to be to be carn- carnally minded is death, and to be and to be spiritually minded is is life eternal. Is life e- eternal. Oh, my beloved brethren, give ear to my words. Remember the the greatness of the Holy One of Israel. Do not say that I uh, do not say that I have I have, I have spoken hard things against you. For if ye for if ye do, ye will ye will revile, revile against the truth. For 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 I have spoken the words. Of your Maker, I know that the words of truth are hard against all uncleanness, but the righteous fear the fear them not, fear them not, for they for they love the truth and are not shaken. O oh, then, my beloved brethren, come unto the Lord, the Holy One. Remember that His paths are righteous. Behold, the way for man is narrow, but it lieth. In a straight course before him, and the and the keeper of the gate is the holy one of Israel, and he 
and he and he employeth no servant there, and there is and there is and there is no, and there is none other way save it save it be by the gate for he for he cannot be deceived for the Lord God is his name, and whoso knocketh to him to him to him will will he open and the wise and and the lawn and they that are, that are which who are who are puffed up because of the learning and the and the wisdom and and the which is yea they yea they they yea they yea they are are they who whom he despiseth and say they and say they shall shall cast shall cast these things away and consider themselves fools before God and come down in the depths of humility he will not he will not open unto them unto them but the things of otherwise and the prudent shall shall be hid from them forever yea that happiness which is prepared for the saints oh my beloved brethren, remember my words. Behold, I take, behold, I take off my garments and I take them before you. I pray the God of my of my salvation that he that he view me with his all searching eye. Wherefore ye shall know at the la at the last day when all men shall be judged of their works, that the God of Israel did. Did witness that I, that I shook your inequities from my soul, and that I stand with brightness before Him, and am rid of your blood. Of your blood, O oh, my beloved brethren, turn away from your sins, shake off, shake off the chains of Him that would, that would bind you fast. Come on to. That God who is the who is the rock of your salvation. Prepare your souls for that glorious day when justice shall be shall be administered unto the righteousness unto the righteousness. Even even the day of judgment that ye may that ye may not shrink with awful fear that ye may may not remember your awful guilt and imperfectness and be may not remember remember may not remember that ye may may not shrink with awful fear that ye may not may not remember your awful guilt and perfectness and be and be and be constrained to exclaim Holy, holy are all thy judgments, O Lord God Almighty. But I know my guilt, I transgress thy law, and, and my transgressions are mine, and the uh, and the devil hath hath obtained me that I that I am a prey to his awful misery. But but behold, my poor my breath my brethren, is it expedient that I sh- that I should that I should awake you to an awful reality of these things. Would I? Would I hero hero up up your souls if your minds were pure? Would I be plain on unto you according to the to the plainness of the truth if ye were free from sin? From sin, behold. If ye were holy, I would speak unto you, unto you of holiness. But uh, but as ye are not holy, and ye and le- and ye look upon me as a teacher, it must it must needs be needs be expedient that I that that I, that I teach you teach you the consequences of sin. Behold, my soul abhorreth sin. And my heart delighteth in righteousness, and I and I will praise the holy name of my God. Come, my brethren, 
everyone that saw th that saw that thought that thought it, come ye to the to to the waters and and to the waters. Come ye to the waters, and he that hath no money, come buy and eat. Yea, come buy wine and milk, and milk without money and without price. Wherefore, do do not spend money for that which is of no worth, nor your nor your labor for that which cannot satisfy. Hearken, hearken diligently unto me, and we. And remember the words which I have spoken, and come unto the Holy One of Israel, and feast upon that that which, which that which perisheth not, neither neither can neither can be corrupted, and let your soul delight in fatness. Behold, my beloved brethren, remember the words. Of your God, pray unto Him con continually by day, and get thanks unto His holy name by night. Let your hearts rejoice, and behold, how great the covenants of the Lord, and how great His condescensions unto unto the children of men. And because of His greatness and His grace and mercy, He ha He has promised unto us that our seed. Shall, shall not utterly be destroyed according to the flesh, but that he would, but that he would preserve them, and, and in future generations they shall become a righteous branch unto the house of Israel. And now, my brethren, I would I would speak unto you more, but on, but on. But but on but on the morrow I will I will I will declare unto unto you unto you the remainder of my words Amen. I'm gonna be reading two Nephi chapter ten. Jacob explains that the Jews will crucify their God. They will. Be scattered until they they begin to believe in him. America will be a land of liberty where no king will rule. We we conceal yourselves to God and gain and gain salvation through his grace. About five hundred fifty nine to five hundred forty five B C. And now I Jacob speak unto you again, my beloved brethren. Concerning this righteous branch, of which I have spoken, for behold, the promise which we we have attained, all promises unto us according to the flesh. Wherefore, as it has as it has been shown unto me that many of our children shall perish in the flesh because of unbelief, nevertheless God will be merciful unto many, and our children. Shall shall be restored that they may may come that they may come to that to that which which will give them the true knowledge of their redeemer. Wherefore, as I said unto you, it must needs be expedient that Christ that Christ for in for in the la for in the last night. The angels, the, the angels spake unto me that there should be his name should come, should come, among the Jew, among the Jews, among those who are the more wicked part of the world, and they and they shall crucify him, crucify him, for that, for that it behoveth our God, and there and there was none other nation on earth. That will that will crucify their God. For for sure for sure the mighty miracles be wrought among other nations among other nations. They would repent and know that and know that he and know that 
he be their god, but because, but because of priest crafts and iniquities, they and Jerusalem will stiffen their necks against him, that he be crucified. Wherefore, because of their inequities, destructions, famines, pestilence, and bloodshed shall come upon them, and they, and they who shall not who who shall not be destroyed shall shall be scattered among all nations. But behold, thus saith the Lord God, when the day cometh that that they shall believe in me that I am Christ, and then have, and then have. And then have I coveted with their fathers that they shall that they shall be restored in the flesh upon the earth unto the hands unto the lands of their inheritance, and it shall come to pass that they shall be gathered in from from their long dispersion from the from the isles of the sea and from the and from the four parts of the earth. And and the nations of the Gentiles shall be great in the eyes of me, saith God, in 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 carrying them forth to the lands of their inheritance. Their inheritance, yea, the kings of the Gentiles shall shall be nursing fathers unto them, and the queens shall be shall become nursing mothers. Wherefore. The promises of the Lord are great unto the Gentiles, for He hath spoken it. And who can dispute? And, and who can dispute? But behold, this this land, this land, said God, shall be a land of thine, of thine inheritance, and the Gentiles shall be shall be blessed upon the land, and this land shall be. A land, a liberty, unto the Gentiles, and there shall and there shall be no kings upon the land. Who shall, who shall, who shall rise up unto the Gentiles? And I will fortify this land against all other nations. And he that fighteth against sign shall per shall perish, saith God, for he. That raiseth up a king against me shall per shall perish, for I, the Lord, the King of Heaven, will be will be their king, and I, and I will be a light unto them forever that hear my words. Wherefore, wherefore, for this cause that my covenants may be fulfilled, which I have made unto the children of men, that I will. That I would do on, that I would do unto them. Why are they are in the flesh? I must need. I must needs destroy, destroy the secret works of darkness and of murders and of a domination. Wherefore he that fighteth against sign, both Jew and Gentile, both bond and free, both male and female, shall perish, for they. For they are they who are who are the whore of all the earth. For they who who are for they who are who are not who are not who are not for me or or against me saith our God. For I will fulfill my promises which which I have made unto the children of men that I will do unto them. Why are they? Why are they are are in the flesh? Wherefore, my beloved brethren, thus saith our God: I will afflict thy seed by the hand of, of the Gentiles. Nevertheless, I will soften the hearts of the of the Gentiles, that they, that they, hearts of the Gentiles, that they shall shall be like. Unto a father, to them wherefore the Gentiles shall be, shall be blessed and numbered among the house of Israel. Wherefore I will consecrate this, consecrate this land unto thy seed and them who shall, 
be numbered among thy seed, thy seed forever, for the land of their inheritance, for it is a, a choice land, saith God unto me, above, above, ab, above all other lands, wherefore I will, I will have all men that dwell thereon, that they, that they shall worship me, saith God, saith God. And now, my beloved brethren, seeing that our merciful God has has given us so so great so great knowledge concerning these things, let let us remember him and remember him, and lay aside our sins, and and not hang down our heads, for we for we are not not cast off. Nevertheless, we have been driven out of the land of our inheritance, but we have, but we have been, 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 been led, been led to, to a better land, for the Lord has, has made the sea our path, and we are, and we are upon an isle of the sea. But great are the promises of the Lord unto them, who who are upon the isles of the sea? Wherefore, as it as it says, isles, there must there must there must needs be needs be more than this, and they are and they and they are inhabited also by our brethren. But behold, the Lord God has has led away from time to time from the house of Israel according. To his will and pleasure, and now behold the and now behold, the Lord remember with all them who have been who have been broken off. Wherefore he he remember with us also. Therefore cheer up your hearts and remember that ye are free to act for yourselves to choose the way of ever, of everlasting death or the way of eternal life. Wherefore, my beloved brethren, we can see you yourselves to the will of God, and not, and not, and not, to the will of the devil and the flesh. And remember, after ye are or we can see you unto God, that it is, that it, that it is, that it is, only, only, only in and through the grace of God that ye are saved. Wherefore, may God. Raise you from death by the power, by the power of the resurrection, and also from ever, and and also from from everlasting death by the power of the of the atonement that he may may be received into the into the eternal kingdom of God that he may that he may praise him. Through grace, divine. Amen. Okay, that's all. Bye.